Hey guys, welcome to the YouTube video. Today it's going to be a Christmas video. This is what all I got for Christmas along with some stuff that I did. I did a deal around the same time and one special item. And I didn't get very much, but hey, it's Christmas. I'm just happy to spend time with the family. So I thought I would show off what all I got. And first gift is coming from my good Uncle Darren. This SS knife for you. All, t all it takes is the heat and soul. And you, all, you guys are going to like this one. Ooh, the sheet's kind of stiff, because I just put it in it today. Check that beauty out. Beautiful bone handle Damascus. Thank you very much, Darren. I love this thing. It's going to go great with my Damascus knives. And I love the box that it comes with, and I love the sheath that it comes with. I don't know how much this costs, but thank you very much. I'll definitely look this one up. And thank you very much, Darren. And my father got me a beautiful pair of RW boots. Check, oops, sorry. Check these beauties out. Alligator skin. Beautiful square tip boots. I am at awe because I had no idea that he was going to get me these. Well, then again, I wasn't supposed to. It's Christmas. Beautiful boots. And they fit me perfectly. I don't know how expensive these were, but thank you very much, Dad. I love these. You know I'm going to keep these and wear these only on special occasions. So I'm going to keep them in the box until I ever get them out. Next is these knives I actually didn't get for Christmas. I technically did because the money I used to pay for them I got from a couple of my relatives for Christmas. So I went to my local Atwoods after Christmas. Sadly, they didn't have much in stock because you know it is a couple days after Christmas. So... They were pretty much out of stock of mostly everything, so I got what I could. I got this cheap Chinese old-timer to modify. The only reason I really bought is because it has a real leather sheath. And I might swap the blade out with an original one. Or just keep it as a beater knife. And then I bought this, what I like to call a Mora look-alike. But as you can see from the brand right here, this one is Cold Steel. It's a Cold Steel... Uh, Finhawk. Don't know much about it. It's made in Taiwan, but it was the only other one I could find that I wouldn't mind having for my collection because I don't have very many cold steel knives. Beautiful knife. It's got a great finish to it. Definitely looks a lot like a Mora. So those I bought with the money I got for, for Christmas. So thank you very much to my relatives. And then at the same time, I did a deal with one of my regulars before then and got this decent bundle of knives. Got a nice little karambit to put in my collection. And a couple of broken blades, a straight razor, and a nice little charade old timer that I'll be cleaning up. And then, last but not least, one of my favorite items I just got is this. A Coca-Cola vending machine. A mini one. I put Dr. Pepper in it because that's all I had. But this thing actually works. I did a deal with a guy, and I was happy to get this. And I gave my old fridge to a friend of mine, or to my mother, actually. Beautiful knife. I mean, beautiful machine. And I'm glad to have it in my collection, and I use this all the time. Beautiful. So that's all I've got so far. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I hope you all had a Merry Christmas. And I look forward to New Year's, and I hope you guys enjoy. And as always, stay sharp and keep collecting.